So in the last video, I uh, showed the ceramic resonators, and I thought, well, let's hook one up and see what it does. So I've uh, hooked it up on a circuit here. Let me show you the schematic that I came up with. Um, so it's a classic inverter with uh, some loading capacitors for the uh, ceramic resonator. Uh, I ended up putting a 1K resistor in here. It didn't seem to want to oscillate without, that, without some resistance in line with it. Um, so that's what we have here. I'm using a, a 74 14, um, actually it's a 74 C 14, not that it matters. Um, and that's what I have over here. All right, so does it oscillate? Yes, it oscillates just nicely. And it's oscillating right here at 3.0011. Um, and it's interesting if we uh, start removing these two capacitors, these two loading capacitors, the, 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 those two outside capacitors. Uh, let's see here. If we take out this one, it shifts over a bit. 3.009, let's put that one back in. 3.001. So it shifts the frequency just a little bit um, when you change those uh, change those capacitors. But if you put both of them in there, you're right. Well, let me take out the other one. People are going to say, why don't you take out the other one? Take out the other one. It's 3.06. Put that back in. And we're at 3.001. So very, very nice. Let's take a look at it in the frequency domain. Okay, we have a nice... Uh, I have it set three megahertz center, so we're right here. Let's uh, zoom in on it. Uh, let's see here, what's our span? 500 kilohertz, got 100 kilohertz, there we go. Uh, 10 kilohertz is here. And we're off a little bit in frequency, so we'll do a peak. And we have 001. Uh, so we will move that to the center. And then let's zoom in a little bit more. And so it's interesting, we have these um, AM fluctuations, um, which I'm really not quite sure what causes that. Causes that. Um, it does seem to be pretty stable on that center frequency, though, but we do get this, um, I suppose that's phase noise. Um, that just may be a real low frequency phase noise, or... It's a, it has AM, so yeah, I'm not quite sure what that is. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what that is. Let's zoom in a little bit more. Um, some of that just may be beating with a sampling of the, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. Anybody, everybody knows what that is. Let me comment below, but uh, yeah, it's interesting. Let's put on some averaging to see what happens. See if that all just kind of disappears or it evens out. Yeah, there we go. It's kind of evening out. So it might have been sampling, uh, sweep sweep sampling of the spectrum analyzer beating with the actual oscillation of the AM modulation. So now that we have a, a averaging of 100 here, uh, we see that there is amplitude modulation. Um, and we can marker delta. Uh, we can move it over here and it is about 109 hertz so yeah whatever there it is I'm wondering if that is just no I don't know what that is anyway it does seem to be uh, some type of AM modulation on the signal um, what I suspected what I expected to see, whenever you do experiments, you should hypothesize something, right? And then see if your experiment uh, is what you hypothesize. So if you have a crystal, it's a very, very narrow little spike. And so the oscillation is going to stay right there at the peak. But with the ceramic resonators, remember, we had, we had a much wider peak, okay? And I imagined that it would kind of drift around. It would kind of say, oh, I'm kind of happy over here. Oh, too far, come back. Oh, too far, come back. And it would kind of roll back and forth. Maybe that is exactly what I'm seeing on the measurement. Um, this is what I hypothesized. That's what I measured. Uh, you know, the next step would be to go back and look at the math and say, does that really make sense or not? Is this exactly what's going on? But 
anyway, I'm going with my seat of the pants, and that's what I say is going on, but I really have no idea. But uh, yeah, there you go. Ceramic resonators. Um, most of the time, they're good enough. <laughs>